Hello, friends and family. How are you today? Today, um, one of my subscribers wanted to topic about how to live on student loan in a big city. And obviously, living on student loan is not quite easy because that student loan would never be enough for you to pay your rent and pay for all your food and uh, pay for once a while a nice date outside our school. So what are you going to do in this situation? Um, actually, when I was in school, I always had a side job, like, um, like a dishwasher in a restaurant. You, um, you don't need to work every day because that little bit of money is not gonna change your life. It's not gonna change your grades. It's not gonna get you a, a better respect from other people. And your go girlfriend wouldn't just because you slave yourself away and look kind of uh, not as hot and smell kind of not as great and your girlfriend just love you better. It doesn't work that way. So usually work one day a week as a dishwasher, um, chances are you're going to get enough of your uh, food for a whole week um, or once or twice a week. Remember to bring a big container and remember to, uh, um, to just just stay to the to the end of the buffet when the buffet ends stay all the way then and and wash your dishes and take all the food home it would be really good right and after your grocery shopping is done by dishwashing see if you only work like four um Four times every two weeks, your your paycheck will be very small, right? So you'll still get your food stamp. And at that time, you can occasionally go to Chinatown to get an expensive bubble tea from a Chinese store. That's very expensive, so don't take it as an everyday thing. Um, this is what I think you sh should uh, live on your student loan. And another thing is that don't spend your money. If you want your clothes, um, you can always get it for, for cheap and um, online. Yes, you, you can be kicked out of the stores because you are not spending big bucks on your on your on your reg regular clothing. And you can see this is walking company stuff and I have it. I'm on a fixed income. I don't earn much. Where did I get those walking company stuff? I don't have to save a whole year to get a one hundred forty dollar shoe wait till it's for sale and spend your MasterCard on other things, other things, and eventually add up a credit and make this sh pair of shoes affordable after probably a year or so. So you, you did save up during that year, but you save up by buying other things. So um you might think living on student loan is scamming government um by by not working that hard you're scamming government it's not really true because um 
it doesn't matter how many ways you try to scam government government will have two twice of ways to get you back there was one year that the whole year i was dumpster diving and working in restaurants digging the leftover food at the end of the year the government is still say you know you earn too much you owe us this 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 much money see so yeah just be honest and um actually when you don't earn much you actually get a chance to talk to people to keep your ends meet you go out dumpster diving that means you go through the restaurant in a hotel and looking for deals and and when you are getting the best deal that also means that you communicate the best with the people our town um, so that's why they wouldn't let you earn that much money it it's just they, they want to make you to communicate um, talk to people get your housing assistance and get get your uh, um, your hair washing stuff from uh, from uh, some kind of organizations so occasionally you can save up to get a nice hair wash see mine <laughs> not the best hair wash but yeah yesterday i did get to use a veda yeah look pretty good so that's what i think about um, living on your student loan um and another thing is how you pick your classes i will talk about it in another video thank you so much for watching i love you guys and have fun dumpster diving have fun working in a restaurant and have fun living on your student loan while working a little bit bye bye